What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna to tell you what the best Warren Buffett stock is to buy this October. Super pumped about this. Let's jump into it because you gotta understand guys that every quarter, Warren Buffett's company, Berkshire Hathaway, discloses its stock holdings through filings with the US Securities and Exchange Commission or the SEC. Now, while Buffett doesn't personally deliver his stock picks to investors, his 13F filings provide an open look into his top investments. And some stocks may no longer be as attractive as when Buffett first bought them, but others remain strong choices. And so when I look over his portfolio, really there's four stocks that stand out to me. I'm gonna give you like the three runners up, the ones that I think are great companies, and then the highlight, the best one, the golden stock for this video as number four. All right, and just we'll hit the first three really fast here. The first one is Apple, guys. Apple is no stranger to most of you. Buffett's top holding, it's a dominant player in technology. Now, Buffett has reduced his stake in Apple, but Apple does remain a core holding due to its strong business model and future potential in AI. Specifically, generative AI initiatives are expected to drive iPhone sales and push the stock a little bit higher. Okay, let's talk about that second runner up and that is Amazon. Amazon, another fantastic company, a company I personally own and love. Although Buffett didn't personally choose to invest in Amazon, it is one of Berkshire's standout stocks. Investments in technology and growth opportunities through AWS, their Amazon Web Services, position Amazon for future success. All right, and finally, third runner up is Occidental Petroleum. Buffett likes Occidental for his leadership. He likes them for their oil and gas reserves. He likes them for their focus on carbon capture. Geopolitical factors like tensions in the Middle East could actually benefit Occidental in the short term. So definitely a stock to keep your eyes on. Okay, now it's time for the golden child. This is my, my opinion, best stock to buy in the current climate inside of Warren Buffett's portfolio. It's the best bet for October and it is Liner. Liner is one of the largest home builders in the US and Berkshire Hathaway holds a stake in the company. And along with Liner, Berkshire also owns another top home builder in VR. But I wanna tell you in this video guys why now is the perfect time to buy some Liner. I also um, wanna say that the federal rate cuts, the, the interest rate cuts that just happened have had a huge impact on this decision. The Federal Reserve interest rate cuts are expected to enhance housing affordability. Huge guys, you gotta keep that in mind. It's creating a favorable environment for Leonard. Leonard's executive chairman, Stuart Miller, believes that lower interest rates will lead to lower mortgage rates, increasing home buying demand, and in turn, boosting Leonard's revenues and their profits. And I think it's a long-term growth plan, guys. The US is facing, and get this, this is huge. We're in the middle of a chronic housing shortage due to years of underproduction. Leonard's management has repeatedly addressed the shortage, positioning the company to capitalize on increased housing demand over the long term. Now, Leonard's stock remains undervalued. Price to earnings or PE ratio is only 12.4, which is notably lower than the 18.3 PE ratio of the SPDR S&P Home Builders ETF. And this discrepancy suggests to me and to most investors, Leonard is an attractive value opportunity. Here's the wild card though, all right? Because we've got two major political parties that have acknowledged the need to address the housing crisis. So no matter if Kamala or Trump win in November, you're going to see something happen in policy that's gonna benefit Leonard. Vice President Kamala Harris has proposed offering financial assistance to first-time home buyers and tax credit to home builders. 
former President Donald Trump has called for making more federal land available for housing development. Both candidates see the issue. They see the problem. Like I said, it's a chronic issue, guys. Now, while not guaranteed, new federal policies promoting home building could serve as a significant tailwind for Leonard's growth. These potential policies act again as a wild card, increasing Leonard's appeal as a long-term investment. But understand, guys, Leonard benefits from from favorable short-term catalysts like falling interest rates and then long-term growth drivers such as the ongoing housing shortage. It's undervalued stock price. It's potential for new federal policies add further upside. So for investors that are looking to follow the great Warren Buffett's lead, Leonard stands out as the best Buffett stock to buy in October. Now guys, if you wanna know what stocks I'm personally investing in, hit that subscribe button, join the channel guys, because every week I'm making a video about a stock that I'm personally buying. And then every day I'm posting videos just like this one, telling you all about all the crazy stuff I'm seeing in the market and some great buying opportunities. If you like Leonard, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Leave a like on this video, guys. I really appreciate all the support. It helps out the channel. So thank you to, to all uh, my supporters, my helpers, uh, my viewers. I appreciate all y'all are awesome. Thanks so much. And guys, I'll be back again tomorrow with another video. Tomorrow, I'm gonna tell you about the stock that I'm buying because I'm super pumped. Monday, actually, I'm gonna we'll buy it on, yeah, we'll buy, we'll buy it tomorrow. Tomorrow is Monday, we're gonna buy it tomorrow um, and I'll make a video all about what I'm buying. All right, guys, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Take it easy and peace.